Hi everyone, glad to see you again. Welcome back to my channel Cyber Network. Today we have something incredibly exciting lined up for you. Our phones are always with us, we use them for everything. But this convenience comes with a cost vulnerability. Hackers know that phone cameras are a gateway to our lives. They can see what we see, hear what we hear. It's the ultimate invasion of privacy. Think about it, your camera roll holds precious memories. Your video calls reveal private conversations. Even a quick glance at your surroundings through your camera lens can give away your location. For hackers, this information is power. Kaylee Linux is a powerful operating system. It's designed for cybersecurity professionals. But hackers use it too. Why? Because it comes preloaded with hacking tools. These tools exploit vulnerabilities in software. Phone camera software is no exception. Metasploit is one such tool. It's a framework for developing and executing exploits. Another is Wireshark, a network protocol analyzer. Hackers use Wireshark to intercept data transmitted over a network, including video and audio streams. Hackers are always looking for weaknesses. They find them in operating systems, apps, and even hardware. A single vulnerability is all it takes. Once they're in, they can install malware or take control of your device. One common vulnerability is outdated software. Updates often contain security patches. Without them, your device is an open door for hackers. Another is weak passwords. A strong, unique password is your first line of defense. Spyware is malicious software. It secretly monitors your activity. Hackers can install spyware on your phone without you knowing. They might send you a malicious link or trick you into downloading a compromised app. Once installed, spyware can record your keystrokes, steal your passwords, and even activate your camera and microphone. You might not even notice it's there. That's why it's crucial to have strong security software on your phone. Section 5. Phishing attacks, tricking users into compromise. Phishing attacks are one of the most common and dangerous forms of cyber threats today. They exploit human psychology to deceive individuals into compromising their personal information. Phishing is a social engineering technique. It involves the use of deceptive emails, messages, or websites to trick users into divulging sensitive data such as usernames, passwords, and credit card numbers. Hackers use it to trick you into giving up sensitive information. They often pose as legitimate entities, such as banks, online services, or even colleagues, to gain your trust and manipulate you into taking actions that compromise your security. They might send you an email or text message that looks legitimate. These messages are crafted to appear as though they come from a trusted source, complete with logos, official sounding language, and sometimes even personal information to make them more convincing. It might appear to be from your bank, a social media platform, or even a friend. The goal is to create a sense of urgency or curiosity, prompting you to click on a link or download an attachment without thinking twice. The message will often contain a link. This link is designed to direct you to a fake website that looks almost identical to the legitimate one, making it difficult to distinguish between the two. If you click it, you might be taken to a fake website designed to steal your login credentials. These fake websites are meticulously crafted to capture your information as soon as you enter it, giving hackers access to your accounts. Or it might download malware onto your device. This malware can perform a variety of malicious activities, such as logging your keystrokes, stealing files, or even taking control of your device remotely. Always be wary of unsolicited messages and links. It's crucial to verify the authenticity of any unexpected communication before taking any action. Look for signs of phishing, such as poor grammar, suspicious URLs, and requests for personal information. If in doubt, contact the supposed sender through a known trusted method to confirm the message's legitimacy. By staying vigilant and informed, you can protect yourself from falling victim to these deceptive and harmful attacks. Section 6. Social Engineering – The Human Element In the realm of cybersecurity, the human element is often the most vulnerable. While firewalls and encryption can protect data, human behavior can be unpredictable and easily exploited. Hackers know that humans are often the weakest link. They exploit this vulnerability through a tactic known as social engineering, which involves manipulating people into divulging confidential information or performing actions that compromise security. They use social engineering to manipulate people into giving them access to systems or information. This can be done through various methods such as phishing emails, pretexting, baiting, and tailgating. 
Each method relies on the human tendency to trust and help others. This could involve impersonation, persuasion, or even intimidation. For instance, a hacker might pose as a trusted figure, like a company executive or a tech support agent, to gain the victim's trust and extract sensitive information. For example, a hacker might call you pretending to be from your phone carrier. They might use urgent language to create a sense of panic, making you more likely to comply with their requests without thinking critically. They might claim there's a problem with your account and ask for your password. In the heat of the moment, you might not realize that you're giving away crucial information to a malicious actor. Or they might send you a friend request on social media and then try to extract personal information from you. Social media platforms are a goldmine for hackers, as people often share personal details that can be used to guess passwords or answer security questions. Another common tactic is phishing, where hackers send emails that appear to be from legitimate sources, asking you to click on a link or download an attachment. These emails often look convincing, making it easy to fall for the scam. Baiting is another method, where hackers leave physical devices like USB drives in public places, hoping someone will pick them up and plug them into their computer, unknowingly installing malware. Tailgating involves following someone into a restricted area by taking advantage of their politeness. For example, a hacker might follow an employee into a secure building by pretending to have forgotten their access card. To protect against social engineering attacks, it's crucial to stay vigilant and skeptical. Always verify the identity of anyone asking for sensitive information and be cautious of unsolicited requests, whether they come via phone, email or in person. Implementing security measures like two-factor authentication can add an extra layer of protection, making it harder for hackers to gain access even if they manage to obtain your password. Regular training and awareness programs can also help individuals recognize and respond to social engineering attempts, reducing the likelihood of falling victim to these tactics. Remember, the best defense against social engineering is a well-informed and cautious mindset. By understanding the tactics used by hackers and staying alert, you can protect yourself and your organization from potential threats. Section 7. Real-World Consequences Beyond the Screen Phone camera hacks can have devastating consequences. Imagine your private photos being leaked online, or your conversations being recorded and used against you. These are just a few examples of the real-world harm that hackers can inflict. In some cases, hackers have used compromised phone cameras to spy on people, steal their identities, or even blackmail them. It's a serious threat that should not be taken lightly. Section 8. Protecting Your Privacy Practical Steps for a Safer Digital Life in today's digital age, safeguarding your personal information is more crucial than ever. With the increasing number of cyber threats, it's essential to be proactive about your online security. The good news is that there are steps you can take to protect yourself. By following a few practical measures, you can significantly reduce the risk of falling victim to cyber attacks. Let's explore some of these steps in detail. First and foremost, be mindful of the links you click and the apps you download. Cybercriminals often use malicious links and fake apps to gain access to your personal information. Always verify the source before clicking on any link or downloading any app. Another crucial step is to keep your software up to date. Software updates often include security patches that protect your devices from the latest threats. Make it a habit to regularly check for updates and install them as soon as they become available. Using strong, unique passwords for all your accounts is also vital. Avoid using easily guessable passwords like 123,456 inches or password. Instead, create complex passwords that include a mix of letters, numbers, and special characters. Additionally, enable multi-factor authentication wherever possible for an added layer of security. Be wary of anyone asking for your personal information. Phishing scams are becoming increasingly sophisticated and it's easy to be tricked into providing sensitive information. Always double-check the sender's email address and look for any signs of suspicious activity before responding. Installing security software on your phone is another effective way to protect yourself. Security software can help detect and block malicious activities, keeping your personal information safe. Look for antivirus, anti-malware, and anti-spyware programs. 
these tools are designed to identify and remove threats before they can cause any harm. Regularly scan your devices to ensure they are free from any malicious software. These can help detect and remove threats before they can do any harm. By taking these practical steps, you can create a safer digital environment for yourself and your loved ones. Remember, staying informed and vigilant is key to protecting your privacy in the digital world. Section 9. The Future of Cybersecurity, a Constant Arms Race The fight against hackers is ongoing. As technology evolves, so do the methods of attack. That's why it's crucial to stay informed about the latest threats and how to protect yourself. Remember, knowledge is power. By understanding the tactics of hackers, you can better defend yourself and your privacy in the digital age. Thanks for watching and learning with us. Drop a comment below if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos. We value your feedback. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more tech insights. Stay safe online cyber network.